Hello, I'm Anthony Hughes, and in this video I'd like to show you how to erase the background of dynamics, playing techniques, and text items here in Dorico 2, the advanced music notation software from Steinberg. Sometimes when writing music, you can end up in situations where space is getting a little tight, and in order to achieve the desired position of a music item, it collides with staff lines or bar lines. In Dorico 2, when you select a dynamic playing technique or text item, you can switch to engrave mode and open the properties panel, where you'll find a new property to erase background. This works over all objects, so you can position items where you need them. Depending on the nature of the item you are working with, you may wish to modify how much of the background around the item is erased. You can do this by enabling the Erasure Padding properties and setting the left, right, top or bottom values accordingly. The default padding values can be set in engraving options and are found on the Dynamics, Playing Techniques and Text Pages respectively. I very much hope you found this video helpful. If you have, just for me, please click the thumbs up button below. That lets me know you've liked it. And subscribe to our Dorico channel right now to see many more videos like this one. I'm Anthony Hughes. Thanks for watching.